a deputy resident representative of the UN Development Program affirmed the continuation of the late Emir's legacy. The title will be passed on to the wise the leadership of His Highness the Emir Sheikh Nawaf Al Ahmed Al Jabr Al Sabah and the Crown Prince Sheikh Mishal Al Ahmed Al Jabr Al Sabah. More in the following report. The fingerprints left by the late Emir Sheikh Sabah Al Ahmed Al Jabr Al Sabah, may God have mercy on him, will remain beacon to the world in humanitarian and political work. It's a big loss for everyone on, in the world. First of all, uh, on behalf of myself, I would like to condolence all the people of Kuwait and the Arab world and even the whole world about the death of the Amir of Kuwait. Now, as you all know, uh, the Amir of Kuwait was the supporter for all the people who are in need. And in fact, many people in the world are now mourning his death because they like him from the heart. So I always remember because, uh, for example, in Somalia, uh, in Palestine, in Syria, and for the senior refugees, he's always there for them. Whenever there is a need, he pledges uh, funding and he is a man that can uh, do the work. And the giving will continue under the new leadership of His Highness the Emir Sheikh Nawaf Al Ahmed Al Jabr Al Sabah and the Crown Prince, His Highness Sheikh Mish'al Al Ahmed Al Jabr Al Sabah, preserving the position of Kuwait. Definitely, I mean, uh, His Highness the, the new uh, Emir is one of the uh, people who was all the time with late Amir Sheikh Sabah. So, as a result, I believe that he's going to take the same role and he's going to be doing the same uh, issues that in, in support to the needy, but at the same time, internally and externally, he's going to do, use the the same diplomacy. In fact, I was honored today because I was at the parliament as well and I witnessed the, the, uh, the blessing of uh, 59 members to his nomination. So this shows how much people are trust, they have trust and they are trusting in his future as well as the crown prince in Kuwait. Kuwait will remain a country of safety and security and an example to be followed in all parts of the world. For English News, Faiz Elbuti.